Welcome to Scottish Outdoor Life. Today we're having a couple hours just at one of the farms. This is one of the farms we shoot. It's a bit of sort of marshy ground, the chance of a duck, maybe a pheasant or two, maybe a pigeon. They've got some boat or rape that we might get some off that. So we're at ducks tonight, so we thought we'd just nip out uh, this afternoon for a couple hours just to see what was here. We've not been out for a wee while. So we'll go and see what happens. And uh, yeah, hopefully we get one or two. You might have been above it, below it, Maybe. behind it. Yeah, you got up on the top there. Here. Yeah. Go back, go back. Oh. Pheasant. No, stay ready, there might be another. Going back in there, back in there. Go on. Fetch it up. Come on in. Fetch it up. Fetch it up. Come on in. Fetch it up. Come on in. Fetch it here. Come on. I don't know how many geese are, have landed over here, that's hundreds and hundreds have landed into that potato field that's been harvested. It's just been a constant flow of them. Not on our ground, unfortunately. So we're about probably two thirds of the way around now. Um, I shot a pheasant, yeah, hit it till he's 10 now, struggled to get out of the burn at the other side, managed to get it, then fell down a hole in the burn at the other side and <laughs> couldn't get back out with the pheasant in our mouth. So unfortunately we couldn't get it. There was another one got up, um, never got a shot at that one. It went behind trees pretty quick. Um, Rowan's had a shot at a crow. Uh, that was coming out of the farmer's sheds. So yeah, it was, it's, listen, it's been fine. It's been nice to get on the ground and have a, a look about and see what deer tracks are in the mud and et cetera, et cetera. So we'll finish working this wee bit in and then we're off to the ducks. A big cock bird. Well, I'll probably come out of the straw and into this stuff. So what? it'll probably come out of the straw and then into this cover. So we'll keep, we'll keep going. Just give this feeder. A quick 
quick check. happened to this <sighs> yeah the dampness has just got into it we've not had We've not been up here really since the, the summer. What happens, this place floods. The barley in here gets wet, clogs the, the spring and then the rest of it just, the dampness then travels up it. So that's a bit of a pain. We'll need to sort that out. It's really early, it's early in the season. So we'll get this, uh, We'll get this tidied up and get some fresh stuff in it, get a new spring in it probably as well. That one's been in for a few years, so we'll keep going along here. Oh yeah. Yeah, they're always in here normally. I would think so. Fetch it up then. Just keep an eye in case there's another one. Go back, fetch it up. Fetch it up. Fetch it up. Fetch it here. Good girl. There it is. Was it under the water? Come on in. Come on in. Good girl. Dead. Good girl. Good, nice mature bird. So this is our pond in here, quite a big pond. Um, we did have bridges, there's a big ditch here, too deep to go over. But the, the beavers destroyed the bridges. Because they were sort of wooden and pallets and stuff like that and they just sort of chewed them and burst them and moved them out of the way so we need to come back up to some point this year and put in proper bridges we're maybe thinking about ladders metal ladders and really staking them in so they couldn't couldn't break them they'll certainly not chew them anyway look at this for god's sake So this is where one of our bridges was, just in here. That can be a good pond, that. Um, but yeah, when they made this channel, they've just wrecked it. It's another big tree, another old tree they've taken down. However, we'll get another bridge all across here and one at the far end. Don't know what Rowan's shooting at. I can't see. I'm in pretty thick stuff, but we'll get it picked if he's got anything down on the way back. We've just got another hundred yards here to go. So
Oh, I was only giving it another one. <laughs> we'll maybe just stay here for a few minutes just to see if there's anything. There's ducks somewhere. There's another pigeon coming. That duck scared it. Oh, come on, buddy. They were easy. They were easy. They were easy. There's more ducks. Uh, they're going away the other way. They're a bit far. These ducks are coming back, Rowan. Just stand still, they might give us a shot at them. Oh, there's look at these three. Oh kinda wide open here. They're a bit high. They probably were killable, but if they land if they're that high and they land away over in here, hey, this is my boundary, just beyond the telegraph poles. And it's all marsh and ponds and burns. We'd never get them. So it'd just be a waste. Yeah. I know I missed them They were sitters. Sitters. My safety was off. My safety was on. I tried to pull the trigger and didn't. Then I got all muddled up and I just I just went bang bang and then oh, uh, oh dear. <sighs> Never mind buddy. Rowan, get ready! There's some in here. I'll try and get them out over your way. Right, well I can't shoot out the tree, buddy. Bear in mind, they were, they were two thirds of the way along here on the fence line before we even crossed the fence. So it was just whatever went in. I think she got what went in. There was only one other one that I, I saw that she didn't flush, but it's that thick in there. Baby dog, come on, in here, in here, come on. Good girl, get on, get on. What's in there? Oh, run! Knew there was something in here. What? Knew there was something in here, she just knew it. Come on, what's in here? What else? Come on, where is it? Come on, in your bed. Clever dog. Clever dog. Oh, she's tired, look. <laughs> yeah. So would I, Dad. Yeah, if you'd run all that way, that's right. Oh, you could get him. Yes, you could get him. Uh huh. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. She could get him. There we dog. Want some of this? Yeah. She's really tired. She is tired, old girl. <laughs> well that's us finished. Uh, one pheasant we ended up with. Shot at a few more, had one, but Tilly fell down a hole on the other side of the river, so that was a bit of a bummer. She couldn't get out with a bird. Um, chased that, or chased, worked that edge of the loch there. There was a few pheasants, but 
couldn't get a shot at them going over the lock and then Rowan had a wee shot at one coming out here but listen it was good good to get out again that's the first time we've been for a wonder this season so um yeah hope you enjoyed it and we'll see you next time